Thank you so much for joining for another video. This is Arlene Stings. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment the link below. And if you're new to our channel, thank you so much for joining me and welcome you to my channel. And today, my wife put all this together and I wanted her to tell us what beautiful it is. It looks beautiful. Mm, it's uh, pork chops, chilitas, some uh, rice with onion, mushroom, and you know, veggie, corn, and carrot. Mm. Some pepinos. Little kimchi right there, my jalapenos. You just have the other yeah. And I put a little jalapeno there for you because you usually yeah. want some juice. Little juice. All right. So. And I got me teriyaki sauce. I know this doesn't need it. I'm going to put a little bit. I always like to put a little bit of it. Yeah, you know, I got my chili oil. You got your chili oil. So, um, I thought we could, um, talk over dinner. Yes, hope you guys are enjoying us in our dinner. Mm -hmm. I hope you guys are doing well tonight. Mm -hmm. To what today? Mm. We're gonna eat a little bit really quick. Mm -hmm. This was making me so hungry while it's being cooked. Mm -hmm. mm. I think if you cook garlic, if you saute garlic or ganyam, you have the best, best smell in the world. Mm -hmm. No? Definitely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so Peño. fragrant in the house. Mm -hmm. it's nice. Kicks off a good a good party. <laughs> My dog's been in the kitchen doing one. <laughs> get away. Mm -hmm. Not your food, get away. Yeah, you gotta kick him up. Mm hmm. Mm, this came out pretty good. Mm hmm. Very tasteful. Tasty. Mm. Very, very tasty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so today, until I have my tequila, I'm gonna keep it for later on. But today, I'm gonna some of my wife's wine, because I don't buy wine. Mm -hmm. But I put some grape juice on it. Mm -hmm. She told me why don't you put some in there, it tastes good. Good! It looks like I drink a lot of wine, but I also do like to mix it with grape juice. It's good. Mm -hmm. it tastes good. Mm -hmm. So, that's what I'm drinking. Mm -hmm. Juice. Grape juice. It's grape juice, but wine. Mm. <laughs> you can get it. The juice. Mm. <laughs> <Still there. laughs> grape there. juice. Because wine is great juice too. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, bad joke. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a good joke, just delivery is not good. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're trying to say. Everything's made out great, but mm. it's got something else in there. Mm. Mm. What you put on it? On the cucumber. Other than my mushroom, I'll put it on it. Mm. Good. Happy? Mm -hmm. Yes. No wonder. It's good. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, question. No. I might do an answer. <laughs> All right. Um. Mm. Okay. Well. Okay, so we're married. We've been married for 13 years. No, we've been together for 13 years. So together 13 years, and October's going to be five years of marriage. So, um, yeah, that's our name. I'm Annie Dub. And um, we decided it'd be fun to do some silly questions. I've seen a few um, online, and they're pretty fun. Okay. So, how would you describe yourself in three words? Me? Describe myself? How would you describe yourself in three words? Strong will, honest, and blunt. Mm -hmm. That's what I think about myself. I'm sure there's a lot of things people think about myself. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's just asking how you describe yourself. Does that sound like me? Ooh. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, good. Okay. Um, who was your first celebrity crush? Hmm. I think Helen Hunt. Mm-hmm. I just think she was the most beautiful woman in the whole entire world. <laughs> Pretty beautiful, but no one you care. Who was your first concert? Oh, that's easy. That's new edition. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, they gave us one that pulled up, got her t shirt, her basketball t shirt on the wall. Mmm. She would go, What do you mean, Estevez? And that somehow, when I saw him, he was like five aisles up. You know, in the beginning, you know, mm-hmm. when you go upstairs in the beginning, on top of the front. Mm hmm. I go, What's he doing here? I wonder. You know, they know each other, they're dating, and they're fun later, later on, like, I don't know, mm-hmm. many months later on, they were dating, I knew it! Mm-hmm. You were there with some friends. Yeah, it was a new addition. Okay. Okay. Funny as a movie. Mm. Probably something like, um... A movie that I loved as, you know, when I think of funny movies, I think of the funny movies when I was a kid. Okay. And one of my favorite movies was Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. Are you? Yeah. Wow. And Up in the Smoke. Uh-huh. That's mm-hmm. cool. Mm-hmm. Cool movie. Well mm-hmm. Okay. So, if money were no option. Mm-hmm. Where in the world would you choose to live, and why? Mm. Where and why? Why? Well, if money was no object, I'd have to um, travel around to see what I where I want to land. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's my answer. Mm-hmm. If I have the money to go wherever I want, mm-hmm. I have the money to travel mm-hmm. to figure it out. Okay. Oh, yeah. So maybe all around the world. Okay. Mm-hmm. I don't know where we're at. I don't know you. Okay. Mm. If you had to wear a t-shirt with one word for <laughs> one year, what word would it be? One word. Mm-hmm. It starts with an S. Really? Should I know this? It's a bad word. That's what it's see. Really? No. Mm. Either uh, that or your name. Yeah, or my name? Yeah, I need better word in my shirt. Mm. Why are you my... so private? <laughs> I don't know if you want me to do that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I don't know, I was supposed to say this. Yes. <laughs> so, um... If I had to wear a shirt for a year, with one word, it would be either, kind of a tie, but it would either be love or peace. Okay. Mm-hmm. You know why I say that? Why I said because every time I, every accident I had, every ticking that I've gotten, any time I feel kind of like, Oh my God! I say, oh, uh huh. The first thing comes out of my mouth. Mm-hmm. So that's what I thought about that. Okay. Just make it easy. The word I would say is, oh. Mm-hmm. Well, that's that's cool. Mm-hmm. Love and peace. Mm-hmm. You remind me of John Lennon. Oh, we need love. Mm-hmm. 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 We need a lot of that. Mm-hmm. Especially when I put the channel oxygen, I get stuck in all these. Who's the guy with the wig's name again? Hmm? That one we just watching the guy with the wig. Kendo? Joe Kendo. Mm. The homicide hunter. Yeah. It's funny because. Usually, I wouldn't choose that for me to watch as entertainment. I'm sorry, but I have to use my fork there as well. 
But then I get stuck to it. Mm. When we're put in it, we need to put oxygen. As you sure as you tell me to put oxygen. I like oxygen. I know. But those are the thick little shows. Well, then I like to watch it for a long time. It makes me depressing. Well, let me put something. Yeah. Yeah. Let me put MSNBC. It's MSNBC better. <laughs> I'm good for it. <clears throat> I'm devouring this. Mm. Don't you notice? Can you tell me, hungry? Mm-hmm. Can you? Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. What was your first album? <laughs> the uh, theme from all the music they play in Rocky. Mm. Rocky one. Mm -hmm. Soundtrack. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That and Grease. Both good ones. Great ones. Mm -hmm. I'm probably hearing this tape because everything I drink is in my mouth. Mm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I want the record up. <laughs> well, mine was the Wham. Wham, you okay? Mm -hmm. That's before you knew they were gay? How many women were in love with him, man? I had some. There was one song that I knew he was gay with. The one with the arms and he didn't pay. Mm -hmm. Careless was great. <laughs> well, my so dad told me. Though, my dad told me, and I said, no, don't say that, daddy. And then I got older and we both came out. And I, <laughs> and I said, I don't know if you'd understand. <laughs> I still love George Michael. Yeah. And it made me really sad when he passed away. Yeah. I don't get very affected by, you know. I do. Um, she does. I get affected when it's celebrity. But that one hurt me. Died. And yeah, I felt that. Mm -hmm. What's a couple of them that, that really, really hurt me? Okay. No. Which would be harder to give up, coffee or alcohol? You already know this one's alcohol. I can't go without coffee. I can't. Yeah. I have to have coffee. <laughs> mm, mine would be the opposite. <laughs> Yours will do. Um, I could live without coffee. I like tea. Um, I can live without coffee. Okay. Um, and I sure like my wine with dinner. So. You know that. Or the monster, and you hate when I do monster, so. Oh, yeah. You're, she's pretty drinking. intense already. And when she's amped up on that stuff, it's. There was a time I was not drinking coffee because it's for health reasons, supposedly, or whatever. I don't know why we didn't drink coffee for a while. It sucked. So I started drinking monsters, and that was bad. Talk about being intense? No! Oh, man, she's intense. <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm The same thing when I try to stop smoking, I used to work with my brother Danny. And I get it was getting to me so bad. I was being so, so mean that he grabs his back and smoke. Please take one, please. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> if you had to choose to live without one of your five senses, which would you give up? Mm. So it's taste, hearing, speaking. Smelly. Smelly. I will get smelly anytime, especially with our dogs. <laughs> that will be the one that we will have for. Good, Good point, but that's... I cannot go with that here. It will be terrible for me if I never have music again. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Seeing. Tasting. What else? Hearing. Is hearing? Tasting? Mm -hmm. Vision? Mm -hmm. Well, smelling? What the other You know, I, I think I'm with you. I'm with you on that. It's suck not to smell again like flowers or whatever, but you know what? Out of all that, that's the one I can live without. Mm -hmm. As long as I can see, hear, taste. Speak. Speak the one. Hell no. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> Give me straight jacket really quick. <laughs> so you two? Um, yes. Mm -hmm. I'm with you on that. Okay. Because I kind of have a poor sense of smell anyway, so. I mean, mm, so 
sensitive to certain things. I, think. I would just like to go where they were smiling the dogs. <laughs> they fart. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's me. Okay, do you have another question? No. You could question me. No, oh, okay, well, let's see. I'm a speaker, whatever you call Did question. I say first concert? Yeah. Oh, yeah, new edition. Mm -hmm. Mine, of course. Wham UK. Why wham? Mm -hmm, that was my first concert. And um and who opened up for him? For them. It was um Katrina and the Waves. Mm. Walking on Sunshine. Mm -hmm. That one. And then Shaka Khan. What? Yes. That was that's a super bonus. Yeah. Anything else? Mm. Mm. Well, we kind of hopped around. I think so. We did everything. Oh, we did that one. Mm -hmm. And then how about the, the supervisor, which is that one? Which one? Uh, we had a five pack. senses. No, so, okay, here. What would be your super? Oh, pack? what would be your superpower if you had one? Flying. Okay. Because I can wear any weapon I want. I can have any shield I want. If I fly, mm -hmm. I can fly really quick somewhere. And... You can okay. have anything you want with you if you want. Yeah, true. If you put a whole thing, armament in the back of your back and right here. A superpower. Yeah. Not shooting anybody, but you're going yeah. there stopping people from hurting mm -hmm. or something. Yeah? Like Superman. Hello, Lois. <laughs> if I had a superpower... Yeah, what would you be? I know, I know which superwoman or man is your favorite. Yeah, I know a Wonder Woman. Mm -hmm. But no, but if I had a, a superpower. superpower I could choose from, <coughs> I would have the power uh, of healing. Oh, that's cool. Healing. That would be awesome. Healing, you know, illness, healing anything. See, it's funny because I portray to be the deep one in this relationship. I go into the deep end. But you're pretty deep. You chose love, peace, healing. I chose super sublime. <laughs> and what is it I choose? Uh, S to the T. I mean, you're kind of deep too. With a t shirt. In private. Yeah, but she always says. I always say she's much. the nice one. <laughs> and that's what's so funny. I'm not that I'm not the nice one, I'm the one that won't go. You know, I will always wait for somebody. I, I don't know. No, but you're just more personable. You're, um, you know, you, you engage with people and stuff. And I'm just, I'm more quiet. And, you know, yeah. engagement is slow. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I don't know. It's funny that when I'm people just, meet up. I mean, I know. It's because I'm introverted and you're outroverted. She's very. Me? She's Me? very extroverted. Why? Oh, my God. Yes, she is. And I'm not. I need to. It's not that I'm. I can't nice, believe I'm uh, even doing this with you. <laughs> but this is a funny thing. People, when they meet but us. But it's, we have fun when we do it. But what, otherwise, what do you mean if you say, what do you mean if you say, when they meet us, they think they are. Um, he says, what do you if you say about me when people meet you? Um, they feel. What was it? Like intimidated or something. Like, what? Oh, because sometimes you look like a tough guy. She has a... Uh, Maybe it's not a money fence. I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know what else it would be. I don't know, but that's what people say. But, but to me, I mean, you're really nice. Well, thank you. Sometimes I'm not nice. All yes. The time. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Everywhere we go, she leaves with friends. Yeah, right. Everywhere we go, she leaves with friends. <laughs> well, I got friends in low places. <laughs> yeah, and I could just go in and out somewhere, and I just keep to myself. It's nothing else. Nice. It's it's nothing against anybody else. It's just um, me. She's nice, but it's like a candy wrap. You got to go through the layers to see the true the <laughs> color, of the beautiful chocolate, and the beautiful heart mm. she has. But you mean more like a jawbreaker. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as easy as a kiss candy, you know what I mean? Yeah. But uh, <laughs> no, but you do have beautiful I'm heart. Just kidding. Oh, yeah, you have beautiful heart. You always. Yeah, don't anyway. be spreading those rumors about me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, this was delicious, and thank you for cooking mm -hmm. really good for us. This is mm -hmm. healthy for us. And I'm feeling a lot better, and everybody in our home is feeling a lot better, yes. Anyways, anything else, baby? So you want to do some more questions another time? Yep. Yeah.
I th- we covered all of them. I yeah, and I'm kind of stuck. Yeah, we're going back to Canada. I'm kind of going there too. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining us for another mukbang. I hope you guys had a beautiful meal with us. Mm-hmm. And again, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Right here, right here. And please don't forget to ring, ring, ring the bell, ring it, and ring it hard. And please don't forget to put it to all that way you don't miss any uploads. And I'm just supposed to like, comment, and subscribe. That's all that's, oh, yeah, so please don't forget to like, comment, comment and, and subscribe. subscribe. That's all like. But then they ring the bell so they're they don't the read it. Yeah. And they don't miss any of your notifications. Yes, that's right. So, you know, just please make mm-hmm. sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Because you don't want to miss any of those notifications. Ring it, ring it, ring, ring, ring. Yeah. All right. I'm She'll be ringing. beating up that bell to yeah, I just, just subscribe. Okay, guys. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for joining us. It was a pleasure spending time with you guys. Mm-hmm. Until next time. Peace.